So hi guys, so in this video I'm gonna teach you how to replace the battery of your Samsung Galaxy S8 and the S8 Plus But in this video, I'm using a Samsung Galaxy S8 for this tutorial This phone isn't mine by the way Now before you lift up the back panel of your Samsung Galaxy S8 You need to hit up using a heat gun All the sides and get the plastic pick or some plastic tool just like this and insert in between Now you carefully slide it surround the phone to remove the bezel so anyways if the back panel had any small cracks you need to be careful because in this video the small crack before get bigger after I lift up the back panel so I immediately asked the owner if that if it's okay but he said that yeah it's okay so there's nothing problem with it but you need to be careful just like this in this video so you can see so you need to carefully lift up the back panel this and after it so anyways you need to be careful because there is a fingerprint flex cable you need to carefully lift up the back panel so I need to ask the owner I guess so in this part, I asked the owner if it's okay, but he said he's okay, so I didn't cut the video for you to know. And I was too lazy to cut this amount of time. So let's wait until for me to get back in my workplace, because I asked the owner if that was cool, or but he said it was okay. So anyways, I get back now. So you need to carefully lift up the back panel just like in this video. You need to some heat gun again to soften the adhesive around. Just wait a couple of time. So excuse for my background noise because it's now raining and it's not so cool because I'm recording a vlog for this video so anyways I'm still recording a voiceover you need to be careful if there's some cracks because this might get shattered and may damage your eyes or some cause bleeding in your hands which is not so cool now you need to carefully lift up the display I the, the remember you need to lift up the back panel remember that there is a fingerprint scanner flex cable you might tear up if you you do it so feisty, I guess. So you need to remember that there is a thing. There is a wireless charging receiver glued in the back of the phone. Just for you to know. Now you need to screw the eight screw holding the wireless charging the speaker and the battery in place. After you open up the back panel you need to shut down the phone so I ask again the owner to show what it looks like inside of his phone Samsung Galaxy S8 and he said that oh yeah Samsung S8 so anyways you need to continue to removing the 8 screw I don't know if this was an 8 screw but in the editing I'm gonna edit if I counted it wrong now you need to remove the fingerprint scanner I guess and the other remaining screws I honestly don't have any scripts so sorry if I didn't give the instruction clearly but you need to follow the video for this to make an easier so I remove the screw so I don't have a magnet so I manually removing the screw of this part which is not so cool because this might get fall down in the floor and so hard to find because it's so small now you carefully lift up the wireless charging because this module is so expensive it's like this and remove the back holding some I don't know what was the purpose of this black plastic around now remove the e screws holding the speaker because you need to remove the speaker 
to make the battery easier to pry up. The Samsung adhesive is so hard to lift up which cause some bent in the battery which is not so cool. So anyways, I don't know if I say this correctly but please excuse me because I don't have any script just saying what I'm saying. So anyways, I'm just reacting in my work. I don't have any script I guess. So I think while lifting up the battery you need to be careful plastic pick not working so I need to use, add some heat I guess and pry it up using a, a screwdriver I don't know what it was but it looks like a negative sign screwdriver because the Philips is a positive one and the, I don't know what is the negative so use the negative screwdriver so please excuse me I don't know what was the tool is so I need to pry it up my plastic to get to just like this look what I did and I, I successfully li lift up the old battery now I need to install the new one so just like this and carefully place the battery I thought the battery was a bit bigger in its size but it's so fit I guess now you need to press down I guess <laughs> not I guess because you need to actually press it down to get in place now the first module you need to install was the speaker just like in this video just push down and next one is the plastic holding I don't know what what is the purpose of this black plastic I guess is this is for waterproof I guess I don't know and you need to reinstall all the remaining screws you removed earlier now remove the screws and connect the battery before installing the wireless charging case if you forgot one you need to and you need to transfer the st sticker including an IMEA address and the model of the phone which is so cool and the next one is you, you need to screw it down in its place so I don't have anything to say just wait I, just wait till I finish screwing up in its place so anyways I shoot three videos the third one is this so I'm a bit tired while doing a voice record because I this is the third video I made I'm making today and it's so exhausted I guess and it's so hot in here in my place where I record my voice I'm saying and lastly you need to install the fingerprint sensor flex and the uh, lens of the camera and close the back panel just like this you need to install some glue around the phone just like what I'm using I'm using a B7000 glue this is the best glue for fixing up your phone just like this some of the technician using a rubber band but in this video I didn't use a rubber band I install a rubber band after I pause the video now I'm just holding in place for about a second to make the glue work just like this so that's it I'm cleaning the bezel around the phone because there's an adhesive residue which is not so cool if I le left le le just like this now I'm testing a wireless charging as you can see it works now say so thank you so much guys for watching this video so for more videos like this just subscribe to this channel and follow me on my Instagram at underscore D